Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And if it's your first time, I hope you like what you see and subscribe. We got a couple baits soaking and we're looking for Atlantic and short nose sturgeon. That's how we're covering the hook. Keeps the worm on a little longer as well. Fish. We're on, friends. We are on. Woohoo! Little sturgeon. Little baby to start the day. Woo, easy. Okay. We're using a circle hook, and that last one got caught right in the corner of the mouth, just where it's supposed to trying to cover all of the hook so that the sturgeon doesn't feel any steel when it picks it up. All rebaited and we're wide awake now. <laughs> Time to get her back out. I know, pretty embarrassing, but nothing better than an afternoon nap, I always say. <laughs> got a wire leader on that circle hook. You notice the smaller sturgeons have really sharp scoots and what they were doing is they were cutting my fluorocarbon. I only was using about 25 pound test. So uh, wire on this side and 80 pound braid on this side and so far it's holding up.
do like to hold one of the rods when I'm sturgeon fishing. Their bite is so subtle, it really helps when you're holding the line. Just a small little tap tap and then away they go. There's a couple taps. Couple heads. Okay, we're on. my friends. Woohoo! This is a bigger guy too. Definitely gonna need the net for him. Probably a mid-30s fish. He's in the bag. There's a little bigger fish. Another nice short nose, probably mid 30s, I'd say. Woohoo! Two more sturgeon in the bag, and that's going to be it for today's episode. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. It really helps out the channel. Till next time, stay safe.